I understand it's a different generation. So there was not a camera and a film and, and that, that everybody matter, reporting matter. on it. Let's rewind the tape. Okay. Did you? You're a football fan. Yes. We're both older. You're not a Cowboys fan. I doubt it. No, I mean, I, I was giving you shit last night, but I, I I think the Cowboys have a lot of potential. Okay. I think that they have a lot of talent Let, on the football field. Drop Go, that. Okay. okay. All right. Michael Irvin. Greatest receiver of all time. Did he have antics? Yeah. On the field, off the field? Yeah, but they, but it was a different generation then. I understand it's a different generation. So he's, There was not a camera and a film and, and doesn't, doesn't everybody matter, reporting matter. on it. Doesn't matter. His antics were, there was probably some whores and some drugs yeah. and some alcohol, a few off-the-field issues with some charges Yeah, that Jerry Jones... Swept under the rug. I don't know he's swept under the rug. But it was a lot easier back then to sweep things ton, under the ton, rug. Tons easier. Yeah. But as a player, did he? you think he worked as hard and, and, and worked out and did the things, oh, ate right? Absolutely. Did all the things that he needed to do absolutely. to work and, and be in the league for Jerry Ross. It was a tougher league back then, too. Jerry Ross played in the same league. It's a tougher league. Jerry Ross played in the same league. Tougher league back then. Jerry Ross now. played in the same league. I understood. So compare him but and Jerry, Jerry Rice. But Jerry Rice and him played at the same time at the same league in that NFL, not and, today. And one of them had antics that you didn't mind, and Jerry Rice had no antics. No antics. Jerry Rice is probably one of he's probably one of the best. He's statistically the best. Yeah. And he played for 20 years, took care of his body, ran up and down the hills, mm -hmm. committed to it. And, and it's a class act all the way. But Michael you, Irvin same same way. He's he's a class act to this day. He's a, he's a class act, but but in his time, like we're we're, we're looking back, antics, we're, looking, yeah. we're we're talking yeah. about antics. Yeah. All right, Deion Sanders antics. Oh yeah, those antics. Right, Deion Sanders. Prime time, baby. Yeah, from Atlanta to San Francisco, he's probably the quietest in his career in San yeah. Francisco. When he got the the Cowboys, yeah. the whole time. I mean, did ne you would, Neon would you, Deion? Neon Dion, baby. Would you assume that uh, Dion Sanders had drank alcohol? Uh, I, I've actually watched some some of his stuff. Yes, he did drink alcohol. He did I would not guess drink he alcohol. didn't. Like he seems he like not. the guy that would never do that. Uh, go to, no, go no, no. To you're the, right. No, you're right. He said he's go, never go touched to, alcohol. Go to YouTube and you're, uh, you're absolutely pull it up right. on Pac Menifee and uh, and Dion. So he never drank alcohol, but did he have antics? Yeah, he had antics. And and his and his foot that's now had a couple of toes removed let him down. I always thought that was a fake injury. I thought because he he even said last night on Monday night um, on the Man, Manning cast that he wasn't he didn't have shoulders built for tackling. He yeah. didn't come up and make tackles on the running back. That wasn't his job. His playbook was sixteen photographs of the dudes he was going to cover each week, and that was his only job. And every time he ever got beat, he was peeking in the backfield.